Robert, we need some EDM templates built for our email marketing. Oh, okay. That'll be uh, $499. What? That's expensive. We can get it cheaper at Upwork. Okay. So instead of doing that, whatever the client says, ask them lots of questions. Hey, what does success look like? What's the outcome here that we're aiming for? What's the purpose of this campaign? How does it fit into the overall business strategy? Ask them lots of questions. Ask them questions that you feel are awkward and probey. If they're like, oh, wow, you ask lots of questions, then you know you're doing it right, right? If you don't ask enough questions, you don't have enough information to assess, to make an assessment and to analyze their current state of affairs. Then diagnose the actual problem because they might be like, well, we just need to drive more traffic back to the website, man, and somebody told us that we should do email marketing, so we need some EDMs, right? And if I explore that conversation enough, I might convince them not to build an email marketing template, but to actually write an email nurture sequence. Because what we know is that plain looking emails get opened and clicked on more than beautifully branded emails. So let's not build an email marketing template that no one's gonna open or click on. Let's write a great email nurture sequence with catchy subject lines that are actually gonna get opened and clicked on. This is just an example, right? So let's do the analysis, let's do the diagnosis, and then, then let's prescribe the right solution. And your solution, by the way, should be one of your fire starters or one of your accelerators, of course. Or if they're good to go, your signature system, okay?